South Korea's finance chief has said that the economic fallout from the COVID-19, uh, the fourth wave of the COVID-19 pandemic, will be inevitable. For more on this, we have Om Ji Young on the line for us. Ji Young, give us the details. Mugan Finance Minister Hong Nam Gi has said the effects of the fourth wave of the pandemic will will inevitably be reflected in the economic indicator starting August, saying that the fourth wave is likely to uh, slow down the economic recovery. At a meeting on emergency economic responses on Thursday, he said prompt support is needed for the small business owners who have been battered by the virus. He pledged to immediately provide emergency relief funds for small merchants hit hard by COVID-19 from this year's second supplementary budget and to those whose income is not in the top 12 percent, saying 90 percent of those who are eligible would get relief by the end of September. He also said he'll do all he can to swiftly use some 5 billion U.S. dollars of emergency funds in August. For more than a month, the highest level of social distancing measures have been imposed in the capital um, area, significantly limiting business operations. He said the government will go all out to minimize the economic shock for small business owners who are suffering and are reaching the limit of their ability to endure the fallout from the pandemic amid the recent resurgence of cases. He also added that tax cuts to help overcome COVID-19 will be reviewed and will announce within this month. That's all I have for now. Back to you, Mugen.